Hello everyone and welcome to Thursday. It is Thursday night and I just finished playing a certain game with a certain group of people. It was this game and it was with a group of my friends. Uh, Thomas, Dan, Jeremy, Nick, and Josh Jepson. Um, basically, I was not planning on starting this game for quite a bit, but Josh contacted me said he wanted to do um, an episode of his highlight series uh, for the multiplayer of Grand Theft Auto V and wanted to know if I would, you know, do it with him. And I was like, yeah, I would. Um, it just kind of threw my plans off a little bit because it basically meant that I needed to play multiplayer, and in order to play multiplayer, I needed to start single player. So I had to start the LP sooner. <laughs> I had to start the LP today. Um, I actually started a little, of it, a little bit of it yesterday and then played a little bit more today and uh, also started the online mode, which is actually separate. So, um, that brings about a few uh, issues. I was going to be waiting to play this until Eco was ready. Um, then that kind of changed and I was going to be playing it when Skyrim ended. So now I've decided to change that slightly again. And uh, it's also kind of revolved around how I wanted to release episodes of this. And I've finally come up with a format that makes me happy and I think it's going to make you guys really happy. Because you guys are actually going to get more content. Um, currently, we have a three-day schedule with our games, and we do three types of games. We do a single-player short-term game, we do a co-op game or a multiplayer game, me and Mal, and then we do a long-term game. So currently, those slots are filled with Last of Us, Mario Kart, and Skyrim. So those have always been the three slots. Before Skyrim, that slot was filled with Minecraft, which is another really, really long, uh, long-term game. So the way we're going to do it is that we are going to do GTA 5 episodes now. We're going to be starting them soon, within like the next week of this vlog coming out. Um, but instead of adding a fourth LP and then doing four days, which means it would take even longer for people to watch episodes of Last of Us or Skyrim or Mario Kart or whatever, we're going to have this piggyback uh, on the back of Skyrim days which means that you're going to be getting Skyrim episodes and then immediately following Skyrim, you're going to get an episode of GTA 5. Pretty neat, right? You get four GT uh, or four LPs, but you get them at, in the same time slot. That means the people that, that don't watch Skyrim, haven't been watching Skyrim for a while, or just aren't interested in Skyrim, have a new LP to watch. Pretty nifty. Um, everything else stays the exact same. I think that's going to make a lot of people happy. And uh, to be honest, it's pretty manageable because I've already already recorded um, a pretty good amount of episodes of this game just because this game is incredibly addicting and once you start, you, you can't really stop. So um, I've uh, started to play this. It's a fantastic game. It is so good and I'm really excited to, uh, to share it with you guys. It is very um, <laughs> risque. It's rated M for a reason, and uh, there will be a warning at the beginning of uh, probably every single episode just to remind people of that, because um, it's definitely a game for adults. Uh, but if you are a fellow adult, then I, I invite you to join me in this wonderful adventure, because it is uh, hilarious and fun. Um, but we recorded the highlights tonight. I've already recorded several episodes of this, um, and there's also going to be episodes of GTA Online, which is all really cool. So, assuming this vlog comes out in the next few days, uh, Josh's highlights video should be out. So if you want to see that, go down below. I'm going to put that down below so you guys can see that. Um, I'm, pro I'm going to try, because I was filming the same time as Josh was, I'm going to try and make sure that my video isn't just all the same stuff. I'm going to try and change it up and use a little different stuff. That's the plan at least. So I'm going to actually wait for his to come out before I bring out my first episode of GTA Online. I'm actually not currently sure what the GTA Online schedule is going to be, just worrying about GTA 5. Now here's the fun part. Skyrim episodes are 30, uh, are 30 minutes. GTA 5 episodes are going to be 20 minutes. But here's the catch. When Skyrim finally ends, you're going to get two GTA 5 episodes a day. Two 20 minute episodes a day. So you're going to be getting 40 minutes of content where there used to be 30, because Skyrim episodes were 30. Um, I think that's going to work. I think it's going to be fine. Uh, GTA 5 is a longer game. And I'm thinking that by doing this sort of format, we'll be able to push forward in these types of games a little bit faster. It works better for GTA 5 than it does for Skyrim, though. Um, basically, what it comes down to is, if I sit down to record an episode of Skyrim, one 30-minute episode generally takes me 50 to 70 minutes, sometimes even more, to do. That's just the nature of the game. GTA 5 
it's pretty much real time. I mean, if I fail a mission, I might have to redo a little bit, but most of the time, what I record, like that's how long it took me. The, the length of the episode is about how long it took me. Um, so, based on that, and based on the fact that there's not, you know, going from town to town, doing stuff in between what you guys see, uh, it'll be a little easier to produce, and thus I can actually afford the time necessary to make two 20-minute episodes. So that's the plan. So basically, the single-player LP of this is coming much sooner than we originally thought, because I had to record it anyway, and I don't want to just let it sit around. Um, so expect it soon. When Skyrim finally ends, you'll be getting two episodes of this day. As for GTA Online, I don't know, but it is a series I'm going to be doing. I know Josh is just doing highlights, but I'm actually going to be doing a full-fledged series, which will regularly feature Thomas and Nick and Dan and Jeremy and Josh. Um, and that's going to be coming out in the future. So now you know. Those are my GTA 5 plans. It was really interesting reading your comments uh, on the other day when I talked about wanting to do a GTA 5 LP. A lot of people for it. Um, some people against it, but a lot of people were mostly concerned with uh, the, the state of The Last of Us LP or ECO. But you have to understand that those are slots. Uh, I consider them slots. So basically, releasing GTA 5 is not going to affect, you know, whether Eco is the next LP that comes out after Last of Us because it's just it's it's in a different slot. That's how I consider it. That's how I've always looked at it, and um, that's how we we manage to juggle three LPs um, because we can keep them very separate. Uh, which means that after Mario Kart ends, there's going to be um, another co-op or multiplayer LP. It's actually going to be Mario Party, and then after that, we hope to follow that up with Donkey Kong Country 3. That's how it works, so you know my inner workings. Um, anyway, that's going to be it for today. Thank you so much for watching. Do check out the highlights video. Um, obviously, we just got done filming it, so I don't know what it looks like, but it was a blast to put together. Um, it was my first real experience playing GTA Online, and it's a fun game. It's a very fun game. It'll be interesting to see how Josh cuts it all together. Thank you so much for watching, and uh, let's meet back tomorrow, shall we? Mallory's grandmother passed away. Uh, she was known as Grandma Dar. Hi, Shadow you Shield. Trying to hide? Cause I can see you plain as day. No, I was practicing. Don't even think about. I was practicing my squats. Dang it.